All right, guys. Uh, we're game time, and we're Hello, back. Some stupid bullshit people. thing. So, so you'll never believe this, but I killed the asylum demon for my first time <laughs> without dying. It was awesome. I can attest that, as I was sitting right here. But as we have no <laughs> video evidence and, to conclude and that, when uh, when when. Tofu here decided to hit the record button to end the recording. The little notification came up in the in the corner of the screen to let us know that the recording was starting. So, uh... I'm not happy. <laughs> but at least we'll be able to try to at least catch the next boss fight. Right, so... The next boss fight's gonna be the, uh... The tower demon. Dirk Souls. Alright, so. That way. The way right I there. was playing it on my 360 at home. Because I'm a poor shit. <laughs> poor shit. Oh, wow. It's all floating. Oh, that's snow. <laughs> I, thought, I, I thought that this was the skybox behind it all. Oh no. <laughs> like, like, seriously, look at it from back here, though. Like, does that not look like it's slightly bugged? A little bit, yeah. Like, with, how, with the overcast gray skies and whatnot. That's funny. Good job, go straight ahead. I like to go swimming with bow legged women and swim between their legs. <laughs> Do I just jump? Or? Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be Fuck! Okay. <laughs> 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 All right. <laughs> the undead Hi. <laughs> oh, no, I was worried for a second that was going to be another boss fight. <laughs> Suddenly bird. <laughs> Lord ran. Oh, yeah, that's the place that this takes place in. Isn't mm -hmm. it? The... So, I love me the shit out of some From Software. Um, well before I ever even knew what the hell Dark Souls or Demon Souls were. Yeah, I used to play a lot of uh, Armored Core. Oh yeah, they did Armored Core, they did the Otogi series, <clears throat> and what's really nifty is that the Dark Souls games are considered to be something of a spiritual successor to the Kingsfield games that they mm -hmm. did back then. Oh, oh, my shield is there. Shrinks. Okay, let's... Vitality, attunement, endurance, strength. Um... What, what does... Vitality at your health. How do I know air. how many points I can allocate to stuff? Oh, okay. And it's telling me the cost of souls that it would take. So... And a larger endurance means a longer, uh, a larger health bar. And slower decay. But you also want strength, endurance, and vitality. Resistance helps. Um... I mean, I'm basically playing a tanky type character, so... Upgrading Vitality upgrades the Estus Flask, I think. Oh, there we go, there's some humanity. <laughs> On this dead oh, guy. Oh, the humanity. I'll just collect some humanity off this dead guy here. <laughs> what the fuck is no humanity? I, 
I, want, I just want to maybe use it. Okay. Right. Yep. Okay. There you go. Now you have one humanity. And now you can use it to reverse your hollowing. Okay. Now we're easier looking on the eyes. That's okay, I still look like a raisin too, so. Yeah, it won't be long before that pretty face is all fucked up. <clears throat> I think you gained your hollowing back <clears throat> once you die. Oh, shit. <clears throat> I bit my lip. Mind if I see a little bit You know, this place will actually be when uh, the I forget what it's called. Oh, he's the guardian of the Fire Link Shrine, and this is where you're at. Okay. And once you beat like half of the bosses in the game, you come back here. He'll come out of that water. All right. Oh. I'm very professional. Oh. Hi. <laughs> so you're just chilling there. Huh? All right. Ooh. Free shit. Soul of a lost undead. Yeah, those are what you'll use to gain souls without actually killing anybody. Okay. Oh, so that's actually like a uh, packet of souls, mm -hmm. sort of. I gotcha. Mm -hmm. Fuck it. Let's Bottom. see, a soul of a large nameless undead. You give you a bunch of stuff too. Oh, this place is all twisty turning in it. Who the hell are you? Well, huh? what do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess. Fate of the undead, right? Well, not but there's this no guy talks creepy. Here. You'd have done better to rot in the undead asylum. Too late now. Uh, well, since you're here, let me help you out. There are, actually, two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below, in the ruins of the base of Blight Town. Blight Town? And something happened. That sounds like a lovely place, Blight Town. Yeah, Dustin likes it. I absolutely hate it. Oh, yeah? It is hard as hell and tricky as shit to navigate. <laughs> hmm. What's fuckery about it? It's also filled with uh, bog poison. Hmm. The best kind. Yeah, so most of the enemies there when they hit you, you do like about that much poison damage, but you're meters are unlike any other RPG element I've ever seen. Okay. So the more poison damage you take, the more susceptible you are to becoming fully poisoned. Once you're fully poisoned, it starts decaying your, your uh, health bar. Okay. I'm going toward Blight Town, aren't I? That's probably the one I want to do second. I forget what part of the world that actually goes to, but I don't think it's anywhere near Blight Town. Well, he said that the first bell, well, no, he said one bell was up and the other was down. Yeah. But I think going to Blight Town, 
No, yeah, going to Blighttown may actually be down that way. I don't know. It's been a while since I played it. I mean, this... It actually seems like it's really densely layered, super vertical, sort of. And now it's laid out. Oh. <laughs> I know, isn't it cute? <laughs> I'm gonna pick a prior top with armor. I, to keep a distance. I want some of them hammer pants. Right. Also, I think if you beat him, you get a chance to get that uh, Morganstone. Hmm. Oh, that Morning Star. Yep. That Morganstone. I knew that was a thing that meant something. I can't wait to show you what I've been doing in Bloodborne. That is not the right way. I'll show you where to go. Uh, go left. It does... It has a very PS1 kind of feel to it. Up those stairs. Oh, that up. <laughs> Ooh, there's some free shit up there. Getting to it is a bitch. Hi. I kind of deserved that. <laughs> I've watched people dupe in this game. Mm -hmm. It's very hard. What does not being hollow actually do? I forget. Swords and undead <laughs> That kind of a silent playthrough right now. Yeah. Or maybe it's because we're I'm both doing... focused. No. Stop.
Shield. Bye. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> this is Dark Souls Kick. This is Lordron. Let's see, where are you? Why didn't. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Award winning AI. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your armor's cracking heavy. And your character knows that. I'm beautiful. Dead body there. Yep. <clears throat> Wee! Wee! <laughs> it really does have a distinct kind of Kingsfield sort of tone, though. Like it, it is a really lonely kind of game. It seems. <laughs> Even though you can have, you know, people like other folks in the game if you want. Yeah. I would just hate for us the fact that, you know, if we were playing this, we would just get invaded. Right. Like, this, this seems like the sort of game that... Oh! That's, uh... Um, a big creature. But you got a soul out of it, though. Yeah. where you're supposed to go. This feels like a trap. Oh. Hi. Where did you... Oh, that's where you came from. Haha. <laughs> Is the crying fitting? That's the stuff. Oh, what the hell was that from? That was uh, a hostess commercial. That was hostess commercial. Mm -hmm. Good night. <laughs> Man, maybe that's my whole entire reason <coughs> this game was so hard because I hadn't leveled up yet. <laughs> oh, did you not? Use the bonfires to level? No. Oh, let's see. Test us up. I do really like the sort of weight and heft to everything. It's just, right. It feels very physical. That's where I just was. 
That's probably where I need to go. I must traverse the white light. Ow! Ah! <laughs> I just want to let you know, your character ate that bomb. Like a champ. It honestly didn't do nearly as much damage as I expected it to. Yeah, you can't oh. get up there because oh. the stairs are broken. <laughs> Next bonfire you get to, use all those souls, get some stuff, and level up. But if I die, I'll have to re-retrieve them. Yep. yep. Damn it. And I think Zombie U had the nerve to think that it was unique. To what? Oh, where when one character died, you would play as the next one. You would go and oh, retrieve your yeah. backpack. Certainly was a thing that just happened. <laughs> yeah, there's going to be a lot of bum effery around here. Natural light, get it off me. Ha <laughs> ha! It's bright. Ah, oh, there we go. Come on, fire. Those will also respond to the enemies. Yep. So, let's be. Actually, up. hold on. Yeah, your level up. Oh, get out of it? Mm hmm. Get out of that menu. Press start. Use the first one there. And then the soul of a lost undead. Oh. You definitely want a lot of strength. That just makes the boss fights easier. Dexterity, I'm guessing, is like the speed of your attacks. Naturally, you would think so, but it just adds more damage on top of weapons. Sitting there, that 
<laughs> Excuse me, good human. Oh. Okay. Oh, I was about to go back. Um, up there you can't really get to. Oh. Yeah, after you get done with the tower demon, you'll come back down through this way and kick that staircase down, and then you can okay. get up and down through again. <laughs> So this is like when you're in one of those bandit caves in Skyrim. Ah! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> he was just excited. He was... Here he goes! Ah! Hang on, hang on. Come on, 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 come on. You need to be oh. careful, you'll fall off yourself, too. Yeah. Yeah, come on, try it. Try it. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> come on, come on, come on. You can do it. You can <laughs> come do on, come on, come on, come on. I believe in you. You're, you're the best. You're the very best, like no one ever was. <laughs> Oh man, you almost you almost got me. Shit, dude, come on, you can do this. You got this. You got me, dude. You got me on the ropes. Oh, you almost had me. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> You'll wanna run through here. This is the best game ever made. I know. And then dip. Yeah, be absolutely careful because that angry shield guy there. And all this sunlight in my eyes. Do you want to switch spots? Uh, here in a second because you're not able to pause this game, are you? No. <laughs> okay, actually, we're gonna uh, we're gonna end that right. right here and then we'll kick it back up. Yes. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Yes. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.